Now Miss Bundles is back in her seat. As she should be. She was here early. Deserves that whole table. And she was wealthy enough to buy all four seats. So, <laughs> just so she could have the table to herself. That's why I've been hanging out with her all day. She's got lots of money. <laughs> well known fact about Melissa, you know her family makes bagpipes. That's not a joke, for serious. <laughs> True story. You know what her family, uh, what, a thousand bagpipes a year your family makes? Yeah. Yeah. I know. It's not right. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, nothing to be sorry about. It's fantastic, you know? I thought that I, I thought she was joking with me when she told me. I looked at her and said, no. Nah. She goes, no, really. I sell bagpipes. I'm like, well. <laughs> There's no way you can make bad pipe noise without bagpipes. It's pretty much impossible. <laughs> okay, as, as Melissa has informed me, there are very good bagpipe players. And there are people who should play the bagpipes in private. Are you leading into an Irish song or something? No, not at all. I'm just talking about bagpipes. Back to your country. Back to my country. What's next? Oh, this one. Thank you. I was leading up to something. I know. Oh, big pairs, big